What's up everyone? My name is Colby. Today I'm going to show you how to verify your domain so you can use uh, the free email accounts from Hostinger on your Hostinger account. And I'm going to be using Cloudflare as my uh, domain name editor or DNS editor. But I'm just going to be walking through the MX records and the SPF records um, just to help you guys out. So first, uh, if you use any of these, you can actually click on this and it will show you a little tutorial, but um, record type is just gonna be MX. So under type right here, oops, under type right here, it's going to be MX. Did I scroll by it? I did. And then after type, it's gonna show your priority. So it's gonna be prio 10. So over here, we're gonna change the priority to 10. And then the host name, alias, or address is going to be the at symbol. It could just be your domain name, or it could be the at symbol. So you could type it out or put the at. Next is the value. So we're, I'm going to copy the titan.email, mx1 titan.email. So what's, what's going to happen is um, your mx record for your website domain, your first one is going to be handled by this domain. Um, time to live, you can set it to auto, but I'm just going to set it to um, what they recommend. Just kidding, I'm going to set it to auto. <laughs> so it's going to be done. So we're going to hit save. And next, we're going to be adding another MX record. And this will be the priority 20, the same at symbol, and just a different uh, mail server. Let me check to see. 20 MX at boom, boom, boom. Yep, we're done. So now we just hit save and we have two MX records. MX records are just the email stuff. Next. And then, all right, let's verify that. Next is your SPF. Let's take care of that. Uh, let's see here. Cool. So with your SPF record, it's gonna be a TXT record and it's just gonna be V equals SPF one. Just be, it's, it's just gonna do this, so. Let's add that as a record, as a uh, text. You always want to change the type because it'll change the fields. Uh, the host name will be the at symbol again. And then the value will be in this content field. And it's this. And make sure it has the squiggly line, dash all. If it's not the squiggly line, if it's the solid line like this, I'll type it in. This will block everything that isn't sent from here. So make sure it's the squiggly line, the little squiggly, and then I'm gonna leave it as default or auto for me. Save that, and we've got the SPF record. Fantastic. This helps with you know spam detection and stuff. So let's check that. Verify changes, bam, both are verified and we're good. So when you jump back to home, you'll see your email reputation is currently poor. Uh, we have to add a DKIM record. So let's improve that. So this is gonna be in the DNS again. Uh, this is gonna be a TXT record. So let's add another TXT. And let's copy the host name, which is going to be different. This goes right before your, your primary domain. And then we're going to copy the actual value here. If your domain provider says that this is too long, you're going to have to contact their support because you're going to put um, quotations somewhere. And it really depends on 
your host or your uh, where your domain is hosted. Hit save. And we're done. Excellent. Verified. So that is that. Let's jump back again. All right. And now we have no other recommendations. We can check our reputation here. It's all good. Um, we can see if the domain's connected. It is connected. And yeah. So, and we also have the catch all here. So, excellent. Jump to our inbox and just write an email to myself. It's info at wpintu.com. This is a test. I'll put a smiley face in there and send. There we go. Cool. So we get this and it's successfully sent. It just, it just took a little bit. I think it took 30 seconds. So excellent. All right. So we have successfully set up emails. If you guys have any questions, if you guys need it on a specific domain, if it's Namecheap, GoDaddy, anything like that, let me know. I'll happily make another video to help you connect and verify your domains using Hostinger in their uh, free email service. So yeah, uh, if you liked the video, leave a like. If you guys have any suggestions for other videos, leave them in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good one.